Welcome to StartCooking.com. Hi, my name is Kathy Maester. Today, we're going to roast a chicken. Buy a chicken with a thermometer already stuck in it. You'll also need a roasting pan with a rack. If you don't own one, you can buy a disposable roasting pan at the grocery store for about $4. Then use either some coiled tin foil or sliced onions for a rack. If you're using a disposable pan, set it on a baking sheet with sides. It will give it more stability lifting it in and out of the oven. Preheat the oven to 400 degrees. Check the label on the package of the chicken to see how much it weighs. A 5 to 6 pound chicken will take about an hour and 3 quarters to 2 hours to cook and a 6 to 8 pound chicken will take about 2 to 2 and a quarter hours to cook. Using kitchen shears, unwrap the chicken in the sink so the juices don't get all over the counter. Since all bacteria gets destroyed in the cooking process, it really isn't necessary to rinse raw poultry before cooking it. Okay, here comes the icky part. We need to remove the innards, which are called the giblets. They're wrapped in paper and stuffed in the cavity of the chicken. They're used by some people to make gravy, but I don't even like to look at them. Wasteful as it is, I just throw the whole packet away. Dry the whole chicken off with paper towels. Rub one tablespoon of seasoned salt all over the chicken. Sprinkle the remaining tablespoon inside the chicken. Make sure this little white thermometer is pushed in and securely in place. Lay the chicken on the rack or the onions with the breast side up. The legs are on the top. That's it. Put the chicken in the oven and wait for the thermometer to pop up. By then, when you slice into it, the juices should run clear. Once the thermometer pops up, take the chicken out of the oven and let it rest for about a half hour before you start to cut into it. If you don't have a rack to lift the chicken out of the pan, you can stick a wooden spoon in the cavity and with a spatula in your other hand, lift the chicken out of the pan. Place it on a large dish and dig in. Enjoy!